Good evening, graduates, attendees. We are extremely delighted to welcome you to Muscat University Virtual Graduation Ceremony, Class of 2020. بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم اقرأ باسم ربك الذي خلق خلق الإنسان من علق اقرأ وربك الأكرم الذي علم بالقلم علم الإنسان ما لم يعلم Dear Muscat University graduates The graduation day is one of the most awaited moments for all students. Today, yet another historical event slowly unfolds as we come to the end of the 2020 class at MU. Our beloved graduates, we would like to officiate the ceremony with a speech from the Vice Chancellor of Muscat University, Professor Yusra Mazuri. Assalamu alaikum and welcome to the very first virtual graduation ceremony for Muscat University. This year is like no other, and I have to say this cohort is also like no other. Personally, this is the very first time I attend or talk at a virtual graduation ceremony. But the reason that brings us all here tonight is the same reason that has brought many millions of graduates across thousands of institutions in hundreds of countries across the globe to celebrate the success and achievement of their graduates. As the Vice Chancellor of this great establishment, I must say that the highlight of my calendar in the year is always celebrating your achievements and your successes. Graduation is always an amazing event. Tonight, we celebrate under extraordinary times, but we also celebrate an extraordinary cohort. Despite the current pandemic, you have maintained your commitment and your resilience to complete your studies and achieve what you had set out to achieve. But before I turn to the graduates, I would like to pause and pay tribute to some people who I think have been instrumental in getting us to where we are today. The first, I would like to, to thank the Muscat University academic and professional service staff who have helped us achieve what we have achieved together. So thank you all very much. I'd also like to thank colleagues at Cranfield University who have shared our vision in the importance of quality education and supported us to get to where we've got to tonight. You will all agree that your journeys would not have been possible without the help love, support, and encouragement of those people around you, the most important people, your family, your friends, and your colleagues. And I'm sure it is worth stopping and paying them a special word of thanks. We must also pause and appreciate the vision of the founders of this university. They dreamt of building a unique, high-quality educational establishment that will not only create the future leaders for Oman, but for the wider region as well. And events like tonight, where they see the results of that vision becoming a reality, renews their commitment and strengthens their resolve to ensuring that high quality education is a top priority for this country. Our founders can be assured that we are truly building a university that will be the beacon of excellence with all the right ingredients, academic rigor, cutting-edge research, an excellent community, and vibrant events attracting leading figures. So, turning to you, our achievers. First, I'm delighted to announce that tonight we're launching the inaugural Vice-Chancellor's Excellence Award. 
This award recognizes talent and achievement amongst our cohort, academic achievement at the very highest levels. So we will hear more about that a little bit later. And to our graduates, we are so proud of you. Today, you end one chapter and start a completely new page. Armed with an excellent master's degree from two amazing institutions, Muscat University and Cranfield University, one in Oman and one in the United Kingdom. You are truly global citizens. You will be looking at the world through a double lens of a local as well as an international context. Tonight, we are graduating over 30 students in three discipline areas that are critical to the development of Oman going forward. Those are business and management, engineering and logistics. All central sectors to achieving Oman aspirations over the next couple of decades. Graduates, you are now armed with these excellent degrees in a new era for Oman, a new, under new leadership and with a new commitment to growth and prosperity. I am sure that you will be able to contribute to the development of the Oman 2040 vision and I will be hearing of your successes in years to come. Whilst you joined Muscat University to gain knowledge and expertise, I hope you have also made lifetime friends and lots of fond memories. You will always be part of the Muscat University story and the wider Muscat University family. To close, I congratulate each and every one of you. Be proud. Take the time to enjoy your success. Take the time to celebrate with your family and your loved ones. This is a great achievement. Remember, though, that you are now a Muscat University ambassadors. Please cherish that and be true to that title and that responsibility. It might be the end of the page as a student, but hopefully the start of a much longer chapter as alumni of Muscat University. I look forward to hearing about your successes, but I would like to leave you with one quote from Cher Cheryl Sandberg, I think which sums up what I'd like to say. She says, fortune favors the bold. I promise you will never know what you can, you're capable of unless you try. Good luck and many congratulations. Thank you, Professor Yusra, for your inspiring words. Dear graduates, our programs were delivered in partnership with the Cranfield University. We thank them for their efforts and allow me to broadcast a speech specially prepared by Cranfield University Vice Chancellor, Professor Sir Peter Gregson. It's a great pleasure to be able to speak to you today as you graduate with your degrees. It's always very encouraging to see students who have successfully completed their studies and are moving into their chosen careers. Congratulations to you all on your excellent achievements. Cranfield's links with Muscat University continue to be a very important part of our activities. Our shared values and closely aligned missions demonstrate visibly that geography should not be a limit on educational ambition, professional teamwork or personal friendships. Our joint desire to help you each to reach your full potential by providing you with the very highest standard of higher education and coaching holds our partnership together in a spirit of collaboration and collective benefit. I'd like to take this opportunity to thank the academic teams and the support staff in both our universities for their excellent efforts. The courses that you've just completed have of course been challenging. There is real personal value in being challenged and improving to yourselves and others your ability to succeed. All of you here today have completed that journey. You have made the grade and you should rightly feel very proud of your accomplishments. Well done to each and every one of you. 
And now you start your next challenge, applying what you have learned to make a difference in the world. Education, especially to the levels you have attained, is a privilege not to be squandered. And I'm sure you'll want to make as much as you can of the advantage that you've built. As you go forward from here today, you join Cranfield's Global Alumni Network. Please keep in touch with each other and support one another. Please tell us your stories, for you are our greatest ambassadors. Whatever path your journey takes, our very best wishes for the future are with you. And in the words of President Abraham Lincoln, whatever you are, be a good one. Thank you. Now we would like to recognize and honor Miss Arini Shahood, student of Bachelors of Sciences in Accounting and Finance, for her outstanding achievement as the highest academic achiever in Muscat University and top among Gaston undergraduate students in Oman as well as in UK. I'm immensely grateful to be receiving this award. I remember two years ago when I enrolled at Muscat University, I hadn't the faintest idea about accounting or finance. It's Allah's blessing that I had amazing teachers and an extremely supportive environment, both at university with my friends and my teachers and at home with my parents and siblings that helped me achieve the grades that I did. I know that there is still a very long road ahead, but I hope to keep making my university proud as it has given me every reason to. Once again, thank you so, so much for this honor. And now, we would like to introduce Lana Samirai, one of the highest achievers within the master's program, to deliver the graduate's speech. Hello everyone. On behalf of the graduating cohort of 2020, it gives me a great pleasure to thank everyone for taking the time to celebrate our graduation, starting from Muscat University team and our guests, to our friends and families. At this moment, and being apart from each other, I know it is not the graduation any of us dreamed of, but with our collective hearts, we have managed in the middle of the crisis to create this virtual graduation. Therefore, I'm thrilled and deeply honored by the opportunity of sharing the excitement of this wonderful day with you. Looking back at the first day of joining, it was just like yesterday. When we started our master's program, it was intensive, focused, and targeted towards our major. Through our educational journey, we had a lack of sleep and an overdose of coffee. I cannot even begin to imagine how we were still fighting despite the stress of submission deadlines, turn it in, and the stomach ache that precedes our final exams. Today is a day of great celebration after the fast and challenging pace of Muscat University experience, it is the time for turning back momentarily and allowing our heartfelt joy to catch up with everyone. Well, graduates, we did it! Congratulations! This is the day that we have been dreaming since we've joined the master's program. This has been one of the challenging yet rewarding experiences in our lives. Therefore, we should all stand with our heads held high and congratulate ourselves on accomplishing our goals. I'd like to tell all the graduates, remember, you are everything the world needs and you can be the leader the world is looking for. So never let anyone pull you down, but instead build your own stage and make them see a better version of yourself. We have survived coronavirus, came to the graduation ceremony and chose to rise, so be phenomenal or be forgotten. Although I graduated with a master's in process system engineering, the outcomes were beyond the technical aspects. I found out that today's learning is a preparation for the future, to be able to meet the unknown, to better analyse the situations and to see things from different perspectives. 
Therefore, we do not need to stop here, as it is the launching point for wider opportunities lying ahead. My parents taught me the value of education, to raise my voice without fear, and to be genuine with my actions. Therefore, I'd like to have respected pose for everyone who has been credited on us, especially our families, who have struggles with who have struggled with us on every single day till the end. So a big thank you is given to you. All the words will never fulfill your rights. Being here, I'd like to tell you that I made the right choice and investing in myself actually worth it. Therefore, I ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for success in our next journey, to be a great example for future generations and to be an important part of this great homeland. Thank you very much. My name is Lana Abdulaziz Asamarai. Remember my name because one day you will hear my name shining in a big place, inshallah. Finally, do not forget to enjoy your day. This is your day. See you. Now is the awaited moment. Announcing of certificates. We will start with a speech by the respective faculty directors, followed by announcement of the graduates. First, the Faculty of Business and Management speech by Dr. Ahmed Ghunem. Dear graduates, I would like to start by saying congratulations on your achievement. This is a very important day for you. You have to all rejoice your achievement. Great milestone. You really did it and you made us all proud. On behalf of the Faculty of Business and Management, I'd like to extend our deepest gratitude. We're so grateful for your time, the effort that you have put through your studies. It's been a great time having you here at Muscat University. You have learned a lot, I'm sure, but more than that, it's about the friendships and networks that you've managed to establish. It's about the people that you've met that would change your life forever, your peers, your academics, and I have to extend our deepest gratitude to everyone who have supported you throughout your journey. I mean your parents, friends, loved ones, and your peers. Now you're more equipped with so many skills and expertise that will make you ready for the job market with all of its challenges and opportunities. Again, I'd like to express our happiness and we're really keen on having you back at Moscow University. For once you were students at this place, now you are our ambassadors in Oman and in the whole wide world. Please rejoice and celebrate this great day. And I'm sure that we will hear so many good things about you in the future. Thank you. Faculty of Business and Management graduates. Master of Finance and Management, Samita Rao. Sahar bint Hassan bin Abdul Ali Lawatiya. Urfa Nasser. Abdullah bin Msabah bin Saif Lamtiri. Nawal bin Salim bin Ahmed Luhabiya. Anas bin Zahir bin Mbarak Nubi. Master of Management and Entrepreneurship. Jasim bin Hassan bin Ali Al Ajmi, Ali bin Haider bin Ibrahim Al Lawati, Nadine Al Tal, Arwa bin Abdullah bin Ali Al Hanaiya, Rami Jamal, Qaisar Tirmizi, Maryam bin Jamal bin Saeed Al Ajaliya. Idris bin Rashid bin Ali al Hattali. Second, Faculty of Engineering and Technology speech by Dr. Nader Musavat. On behalf of the team in the Faculty of Engineering and Technology at Masrat University, it's my great honor and pleasure to congratulate you today on your graduation ceremony. My name is Nader Musavat. I'm the director of the engineering and technology department at Maskat University. 
Congratulations to you, your family, and your friends for your great performance and achievements in your MSc study at Masfat University and in the Faculty of Engineering and Technology. All the hard work, good performance, and the accomplishments you have done, and also for the experience you have shared with us as well as with your peers in your class, and also for all the challenges that you overcome during your study with us. I'm sure now you're equipped and prepared to tackle all the challenges ahead of us in health, in energy, and also in environment. Dear graduates, as a process systems engineer or as an energy systems engineer, you must do all you can do. On top and beyond your success and realization of your ambitions and aspirations, I want you to actively engage in developing alternative resources for energy or renewable energy resources, as well as I want you to develop more efficient, energy efficient processes in different industry and different sectors. I also want you to develop innovative solutions to combat environmental challenges and climate change. And finally, I wish you the best of luck in your career and in your next chapter of life, and let's stay in touch. Faculty of Engineering and Technology graduate, Master of Energy Systems and Thermal Processes, Mohammed bin Hamad bin Mohammed Al Barwani. هدى بنت ناصر بن محمد العبرية سيف بن محمد بن سيف لوهيبي Master of Process Systems Engineering لانا عبد العزيز السمرائي غالية بنت خلفان بن أحمد المحروقية عبد السلام بن راشد بن سالم المشرفي خميس بن علي بن راشد المقرشي مناف بن سالم بن أحمد الكثيري زاهر بن ناصر بن حمود الشقصي يشبال نيكي طلال بن طالب بن خميس لبلوشي سيف بن مسلم بن علي الحاشمي Finally, Faculty of Transport and Logistic Speech by Dr. Nicholas Hubbard. Right. Hello, everyone. Many congratulations in terms of achieving your awards today. Um, you should be incredibly proud of your achievements. And for us at Muscat University, it is an important step that you are the first graduates in the Faculty of Transport and Logistics and we are also justifiably proud of you. There's never really been a time um, where things have been so difficult in the world. And yet, those involved in logistics, supply chain management, and air transport have enabled the people of the world to still continue with having a wide variety of goods uh, to eat, a wide variety of clothing and other items that they can utilize. Um, and all of this is because of the expertise of logistics, supply chain, and air transport uh, managers. Go out there, do your bit for this, do your bit within an industrial field that is growing massively in Oman. And I hope that in a few years' time, I'll be able to see how successful you've been and you can come back to the university and give us a guest lecture. How's that for an offer? So enjoy your day. Many congratulations again. And I wish you all the best in your future careers. Faculty of Transport and Logistics graduates. Master of Air Transport Management, Manal Bijawi. Fahad bin Abed bin Sa'id al Kharousi, Master of Logistics and Supply Chain Management, Ali bin Salim bin Ali al Kilbani, 
حسام بن سليمان بن يعقوب النعماني يوسف بن سالم بن عمر الرميضي تميم بن حمد بن سعيد البوسعيدي Introducing the graduates' messages. I am thrilled to share with you that I have graduated from Muscat University, Facility of Transport and Logistics, with a master's degree in air transport management. Thanks, Muscat University, for giving me this opportunity. Extremely grateful for the challenging and yet an amazing journey. Special thanks to my family, friends, and all those who were part of my journey to success for the endless support and collaboration. Looking forward. I would like to congratulate all 2020 grads for this achievement. Thank you, Muscat University, for the past two years. They have been extraordinary. Looking forward for what's laying ahead. Alhamdulillah, alladhi allam al-insana ma lam yalam. Wa salatu wa salam ala muallim al-umam Sayyidina Muhammadin wa ala alihi wa ashabihi wa sallam. Amma ba'd. أيها الحفل الكريم إنه لشعور جميل التخرج من هذه الجامعة وارتداء هذه القبعة وهذا اللباس شعور جميل جدا هنيئا لكم Class of 2020, congratulations! You are now officially MU alumni. It's time to embark on a new chapter of your life. We wish you all the best in your future career and life. Wishing you all a lovely evening.